Hey guys, it's me Dave back on the Kodo server playing Infinity uh, Feed the Beast. Uh, did a little bit of work. I got my um, my other turtle down here digging away. I need more materials. I started with getting a laser and an assembly table going. What I'm looking to create is some robots. It's a little early game for that, but I figure it's going to take a while to get the energy that I need uh, to make them, so I might as well just let them go. Uh, I have the chunk lower sitting here so that everything is functioning while I'm not in the area. Uh, I took out one of the buildings in the town and Jack and Marissa left. So that's a quick update of what's going on. Uh, but I took away one of the buildings here to make this this garden bigger. <clears throat> Um, as you can see, I duplicated this. I just got to put the roof on it. I'm thinking about taking this away and making this area a uh, Tinker's Construct area. Maybe make a different style building around it because this is kind of like just a useless structure. But what I want to do... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> what I want to do is get an extractor running uh, off of my power line hopefully I can I can do that so that I can start to extract uh, tons and tons of um, rubber so that I, I can use those those pieces I can get a little tree farm going and make a little bit more usefulness out of these these trees plus then I know I'm gonna need a ton of rubber for most of the stuff that I'm looking at making so let's get an extractor up and running and see where that takes us. Get some light over here. I never really am in this area when it's nighttime. Let me cut down the rest of these trees, get some light going, and then uh, we'll work on that extractor. So the first couple of episodes, there's always like getting everything set up. Um, that's why I'm going to get the extractor going this episode. Holy crap. And get rid of these dark spots here with this thing. Um, so this is definitely going to go. I'm going to put Tinker's Construct here. Um, with the robots, I'm hoping that I'll be able to run a tree farm. I'm pretty new to robots. I know the robots came out about a, almost a year ago almost uh, for Buildcraft. But uh, really, I haven't played a lot in the last year. So I, I'm not familiar with them. So let's get the stuff going that we need for the extractor. This is cooking up. Apparently carrot seeds are a thing now. Um, put them there. I'm not really doing witchery right now. But like lots of rubber saplings. That's why I'm going to use uh, robots to get a farm going and just take care of all of those. <clears throat> My voice is a little off today. I have a Coming down a little cold. So let's see what we need here. You make this guy. We're going to need a lot of iron. All this IC2 stuff uses a ton of iron. So what I'm going to do is once I have this up, I'm just going to go cut down a ton of trees. I need that. And I think I need three of these. Like this, with these two. Yep, perfect. I'm going to need copper. Is that copper? Yeah. Alright, looks like, looks like Chris joined. He should be at work today, though. So I don't know what's going on there. But, anywho, let's get this going. We need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 of these. That's only 7. Boom. Basic machine. This guy is going to need one of these. And then I, I can never remember how to make this. So that gives me two. I need six. So one, two, three. This stuff is so much better once you can automate it. And let's get these. 
perfect. Redstone. Bam, like that. So now I need four of these. And we've got an extractor. And hopefully it can run off of the RF power. I'm hoping. If it can't, it'll just explode. <laughs> RF protect. I think I need to convert this. There we go. My, uh, my fraps, uh, crashed there for a second. Um, energy. I wonder if there's like a converter. Counter. Energy cell, no. Uh, let me, let me do a little bit of research into this. And see what I need. Give me a second. Okay, well, we're going to have to do some experimenting because I do not want to blow up my extractor. But I also don't want to put it next to this guy and have him explode. So what I'm going to do is make another energy cell, smaller one. They only outputs the smallest amount of EU, I guess. And then... Um, See if they can handle it. Energy cell. Let's make a regular one here. So we need this. Electrum. I don't know if I have electrum. I do. So apparently. Could be a little bit of a hold on tearing down that that building and putting uh, Tinkerer's construct stuff in there. Because I'm doing this now. Leadstone, it's lead. Uh, have lead in here, right? Lead. Any more? How's this going? At least this will make um, make obsidian, which I need. I need some of. Okay, where is all of my redstone? Definitely need more of that. Oh, I need one of these. I was just about to break it down to make more. What the hell? Alright, let me get the stuff I need. This is ridiculous. Alright, so let's see what we can do here. Um this will be the ultimate test. If I can connect this. Appears to connect into it. Um, so maybe we can use these together. I didn't think we would be able to. I think at daytime just when I'm getting sneak attacks from above because I never build roofs on any of my houses. Let's go with this guy and a max output of 50. And let's see what happens. Here it goes. Let's charge up. Seems to be working. And this is going to power up. It's going to have plenty of power to power this guy right now, who's kind of in a bad spot. But, sweet. It's working. This is still going. I'm actually going to take all these out here. I just want one. No. I want three. Now that this is running, this will run overnight. And hopefully... This will finish. And we'll 
I'll just load this up. Um, my guy down here is going to find some more anyway. But we got the extractor up and running, which means I can start to plant a ton more of these trees. Let me get rid of all this stuff. There. I can plant a ton more of these trees. We can get a lot more rubber going. And everybody will be happy. What I'm going to do in the off times, I'm going to tear this building down and make the Tinker's Construct building. So then come back next time, they'll be ready to go. Um, for now, let's just plant these trees here. And we'll come down and we'll cut these down later once they've grown. But, alright. My one villager is still alive, who has a horrible trade, but I do need emeralds. So I'm actually going to trade him right now, so in case he dies. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get killed. Uh, he wants four for four. We'll do that. We don't want to trade him the charged ones. Those are expensive and rare. So at least we have some emeralds before he dies. Because we will need these. He should get a new trade. Oh, there it is. He's getting it now. It's going to be something stupid, isn't it? What do you get? Apparently nothing. Why? Whatever. Alright, I'm going to work on tearing this down, and then we'll be back for the next episode. We'll do some Tinker's Construct, and hopefully um, getting a little bit more set up in here. Maybe a roof. So, I thank you for tuning in. I am Dave from the Kodo. Like always, guys, good luck, and have fun.